speaker is going to take our first speaker will take us through the products. And of course, today we are looking at a very exciting range of products. That is the herbal alternatives. We rarely talk about them, but I thank God that today we found a great speaker who is well seasoned to be able to take us through this. So uh, I'll start with Alice Munyense coming on board so that finally once she finishes, she can welcome the next speaker to be able to do the, the other part. So welcome on board, Alice. Unmute yourself. Thank you very much, uh, PT, Pieros, uh, for giving me this opportunity to be able to share. It's a great honor and privilege to be talking to you this evening. I hope you can hear me. Yes, we can. Okay, thank you. Uh, as you have heard, my name is Alice Munyenze. I am married and a mother of uh, two young men. And the New Life Opportunity found me while still working with the county government. And at that time, I remember I was, I, I had started getting worried uh, because I was nearing retirement. I was worried of how I would retire. And why was I worried? Because I had started getting health challenges. I was visiting the hospital frequently. And um, uh, I knew that when I retire, I'll not have a medical cover and uh, the pension would be little. So I was worried where I would get the money uh, to, uh, to go to hospital. But uh, uh, I received a message inviting me to attend to a meeting of the opportunity. And I came and listened and uh, I joined immediately and started using the, the products, the new life products. And I say when I was given that the pack of Pro Vitality, I used it for only one week and the headache that I was having went away. So the new life products are very powerful. And uh, I used the products uh, and because I, start, I had started getting health challenges, I researched uh, among other products that the New Life Company has, and I added to the Pro Vitality, and I got well, and my health was restored back. And I stopped go visiting the hospital frequently. Uh, and even now, I cannot remember even when last I visited the hospital, because when you are not sick, of course, you will not need to visit the hospital. So I just go for the normal checkup and um, I'm well. And I thank God for that. So I will uh, be talking to you today about the herbal alternatives, and the herbal range. Um, and we know like uh, herbs, uh, herbs give us a uh, wellness, the general wellness because herbs are very important uh, in our well-being. And uh, as we know, the, the herbs are ancient. And li like we know uh, when uh, God created man, the first foods were just herbs and vegetables. So the herbs are very good for our, our wellness. And of course, we know uh, some communities that are well known for using the herbs, uh, like the Asians, the, the Asians, uh, the Chinese and the Indians, uh, they, they use the, the herbs uh, very much. And they are known to have good health because of the, the herbs. Also in Africa, uh, uh, the herbs were, were used but then in Africa, the herbs sometimes were looked at as 
uh, mostly to do with witchcraft, witchcraft. So they they are not very famous in Africa. And so um, we we are going to look at uh, the 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 alternative, the harbor or range for our new life company. And we will start with the uh, the first harbor alternative is the aloe vera juice, the aloe vera plus. And we find that there are key features for the aloe vera juice. Uh, the aloe vera juice for the new life is made from uh, the finest aloe vera and is of very good quality. Uh, it, it, it has also got um, the, the chamomile, the chamomile, uh, the chamomile and, and also, and also the, the a special tea, herbal tea blend that uh, energizes and helps in calming. So we find that our uh, the new life aloe vera plus is good, is very good and very uh, calming. And especially it's good for uh, people who are, who have got uh, ulcers. Uh, it's good for people with uh, uh, stomach disorders. And also is it's a very, good product with very good flavoring. Uh, uh, it, it has uh, herbal tea and the fragrant uh, citrus flavor uh, for sweetening. And those adds a great taste to our aloe vera plus juice. So you find that the aloe vera is very good and especially for people who um, are stressed, they can use aloe vera because it is it calms one and it is able to make one to relax uh, and even to be able to have very good sleep. So it's a very good uh, uh, hub, hub uh, and it's very great for our bodies and gives us uh, to have a general wellness. Uh, we also go to another uh, another product for another product for the the uh, uh, herbal range. We have the the feminine herbal. We have the feminine herbal product, and this is a a, a herbal product for women, and. Uh, the herbal product for the, the feminine herbal product is um, very good for balancing the women's hormones. It is it, it is good and especially for the women uh, during their cycles, they do have a, a complication. It it has calming uh, herbs that are able to calm the the. The, the woman uh, to, to be able even to balance the hormones to prevent one from harm, having the mood swings. It's a, it's a comprehensive formula uh, and provides uh, herbal, herbals that are able to optimize uh, and support a woman's unique cycle needs. Uh, they are, we have in the masculine herbal, it has a combination of special herbs and they are selected from uh, the, the, they are uniquely selected. And as you know, our, our products are especially made because they, 
They are researched by the scientific advisory board and they are ensured that they, they give us the wholeness that we need. So the, the Femina in Habo has got a, a hub called the St. John's Watt, which has been shown to support calmness, release mood, and supports mental attitude. So you find that uh, a woman will not be affected by the normal cycle, the monthly cycle. Uh, they will not have uh, changes in moods or have uh, other disorders that come with uh, the monthly cycle. The hormones will be balanced. We, we also know that uh, some women are not able to conceive because they have a hormonal imbalance. And when they use the, uh, the new life feminine herbal, the, the, the hormones are balanced and the women are able to get children. So um, uh, the, the feminine herbal is very good for, for women. And uh, this one can be taken up to when uh, a girl uh, starts her cycle from the age of 13, and they will be able to grow well in calmness and not have issues that come with a uh, hormonal imbalance during uh, that monthly cycle. So the, the feminine herbal is a very good uh, herbal. Another product uh, among the among the the herbal range for new life is the masculine herbal, which is a a very good herbal for men. Uh, it enables a man to function properly and uh, helps a man to be able to to be able to balance the hormones, um, to balance the hormones of the man and help them to be stable, help them to have a proper prostate functioning. Uh, and also the, the, the masculine herbal also prom promotes the, promotes the, the man's, uh, male provitality that they are able to function properly. And also uh, these uh, herbs, the, the herbal alternative, they also prevent um, uh, 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 the cancers that come with hormones, like the prostate uh, uh, cancer, so when one uses uh, the masculine herbal, one is able to prevent themselves from getting these uh, cancers. And uh, uh, as we know, we are told prevention is better than cure. So it's better to prevent ourselves. Also like the feminine herbal, the women will be able to prevent themselves from cancers like the, the the savvy cancers, the breast cancers that are common with women. And most of these cancers come because of hormonal imbalance. So when the balance are, when the hormones are balanced, one is, uh, uh, will not be able to get this kind of, uh, this kind of uh, 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 cancers. So the, 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 fem, the feminine herbal and the masculine herbal are very good, um, are very good uh, products for the man and woman. And we also know that uh, this, the, the feminine herbal and the mas masculine herbal are not uh, products that you take continuously. Uh, you are, one is supposed to take one, once or twice in a year. So uh, I think it's easy to, 
to use and to afford uh, to use them in such a way. And um, and the the the, the, the mask line harbor, the mask line harbor also contains the Saint John's Wort that is um, as a, is is known to bring calmness and relieve low mood and uh, and support attitude. So you find that uh, the man is uh, in very good. Uh, wellness to function properly. And the next uh, uh, harbor range for the new life ranges is the, the mind enhancement. And this is a, a very good product. It's a, a unique product that is help to ensure that uh, the mind, the brain is functioning properly. And it is, it is very good. Uh, and especially uh, for children, uh, school going age children, uh, gives them to be alert and helps them to concentrate. So it's a, a very good product. It's very powerful uh, and it contains several herbs that uh, work in the mind to ensure that the mind is stable. Uh, one is able to concentrate, one is able to pay attention, one is able to be alert. So the, the, the herbs, the, 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 the mind enhancement complex is able to put us uh, in our, in our right state of mind. And in fact, the mind enhancement uh, is able to help one, and especially if one is going through a difficult situation, one is able to stay at their right mind uh, uh, and be able to uh, think clearly, visualize clearly, and be able to make the correct uh, the correct decisions uh, to be able to remain focused and to, to be able to remain thinking clearly. So it's a very good uh, supplement. And uh, especially when children are nearing uh, to do the exam, if they use this product, it gives them alertness. It helps them to be able to remember easily what they have learned and to be able to, to concentrate and, and especially to, to be able not to have panic uh, during exam. As we know, sometimes uh, when um, people are going to sit for ex exams, they panic and uh, when they panic, they don't think clearly. So this supplement is able to give them calmness is able to help them to be able to concentrate and do well in class and also do well in their exams. So, and we have uh, the next uh, uh, range is the herbal respiratory. And this is a, a very uh, good uh, herbal product. And especially for people who have uh, respiratory disorders, uh, people who have asthma, uh, they, they are able to have a, a good respiratory system. And also people with allergies. This is a very uh, good product because you find that uh, people who have allergies mostly react to like things like dust and they, they are not able like to stay in a dusty place and they, are, they, 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 they usually have chest condition, congestions, which is a respiratory disorder. And um, this product, the herbal respiratory is able to help them to have a healthy respiratory system. 
and not have chest congestions. And it's also very good for people who have asthma. It will be able to help them. Uh, as you know, the people who have asthma, asthma always use, um, use inhalers. But when one is in this pro using this product, is able to be stable, to have a healthy respiratory system, and uh, will not always be be using the inhalers. And you, you know, this is a natural product. It will not bring other side effects. Unlike the inhalers, they can have other side effects. But uh, the the new lines herbal range are natural. They don't have any side effects. So one is able to have the total wellness and they are able to stay healthy. And uh, I, I think that is all about the herbal range for the New Life uh, company. And thank you very much for listening to me. And uh, I will. Welcome the next speaker, Mr. Macharia, to take us through the next topic. Thank you very much. Thank you. Thank you, Harris, for a well-prepared presentation. I hope uh, you can hear me. Just wave if you can hear me. Yes, we can hear you, Macharia. Thank you. So uh, good evening, everyone. I know we are there and we are eager to run. And uh, we thank Aris for enlightening us on this. I know it's a wide topic and uh, we continually run. Every time we come to the meetings, I know we run something. So my name is uh, Harun Macharia and uh, I am a marketer by profession. And I found this opportunity, or rather this uh, opportunity found me when I was looking for a, an alternative income generating uh, activity. So I'm not going to go much into introduction because of time, because I've seen we have uh, taken uh, some time. I'm rushing to the topic of the day. Um, today we are going to look at um, the sponsoring versus recruiting and duplication so and uh, you know that, that's a, a a wide topic but we are going to touch uh, bits by bits and uh, be able to actually have a clue of what we are supposed to do in that kind of a in this in this uh, in this forum uh, in uh, uh, we'll start with the uh, recruiting and you know recruiting is a term synonymous with um, the military and uh, when you talk of recruiting, you are talking of masses. And you know, with, with our business, the network marketing business, it is a game of numbers. So we have to accept also recruiting is a good thing, but uh, it has its shortcomings because when you talk of recruiting, you're just bringing people in and putting them into the system to look for their own ways and means of doing their things. So. Uh, most of the times you find that the most of the people who are brought in by recruiters they are not mentored they don't have mentorship so they actually don't know what they are supposed to do and they look like they know what they are, they, they are doing and rush to introduce other people who get also very much confused in the, in the in the system so many will die along the way because you know it's just like a baby when you get a baby and you don't feed the baby uh, the baby will die. So the new recruits are like babies. And when you put them into hardship, because uh, our business is not that simple. It is easy, but not simple. Uh, so you can put them into the system thinking that they will do it for themselves, but they will not. So it is, it is also a very short term gain, which uh, we don't see good result at the end. We will have many people coming in and maybe you achieve a short term gain, and then at the end of the day, you lose all these people. So we have to accept that this is the way to start. And this is the way the way to start as a recruiting uh, uh, machine. But we have to very fast and uh, carefully 
sponsor these people into the system. And the system or uh, sponsoring is where uh, a sponsor or somebody uh, like now me and you as distributors, we bring in people and teach them effectively to start their own business. So that is nothing else but sponsoring. Sponsoring is when you eagerly and keenly look at helping other people to come into the business and become successful. And who is this sponsor? Because we have uh, that term in social circles where we know uh, a sponsor and we associate a sponsor with a very different kind of a thing. But true sponsors, even in social uh, circles, they're those people who bring up people to a certain level of dependence. Uh, dependence. So you are able to bring somebody, maybe you start a business for them and you're able to make them run on their own. So, but in our side of uh, sponsorship, it is not on the normal uh, social circles. This is where you introduce people into network marketing and successively help them to build their own business. So you are supposed to do several things to your downlines. When you bring your people, you call them downlines. Those downlines that you have, you are supposed to teach them several things. And one of the key thing is as a sponsor, you're supposed to let them know how to do their name list. And this is the starting point because you want to mature your, your, your downline very fast because you are bringing in many. We have, we have talked of a, 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 a game of numbers. So you're not having only one person and you mentor that person. You need to graduate them quickly to become very independent so that you have other people to mentor. And this is, that's our joy. So you also know to train these people how also to depend on themselves to do their orders, to, uh, to prospect, and also to even do and obtain, uh, help them to obtain business materials. Uh, you also introduce them to the system. You let them know how the system runs. So they're able to, uh, to do their own things with, with a retro uh, expectation from you. So what you're not supposed to do as a, as a sponsor is to do the business for your downlines. I find that very much uh, happening in, in the system where you tell people that, don't worry, I'm going to do for you. I'll do the orders for you. But that one, you are retarding your downlines and it's going to become a big problem for you because these people are not mature. It's just like having a kid who is dependent to their parents even at their old age. So that is very, very risky. So you show them how to prospect, how to effectively invite. And as a sponsor also, you are able to show them, you're supposed to show them how to do presentation and forums. So when you do that effectively, you are a real business sponsor. And you should be very proud to be called a sponsor because this is showing that you have uh, instincts to uh, bring up a family. You are, it's, it's, uh, we call ourselves a, a, a near a family. You are able to be part of the uh, part of bringing up a family. So as a sponsor, you should mature your nursery very fast. You should not babysit them for too long. You should babysit them, but not for too long. So you should mature them very, very fast. So, but you should remember, you should not abandon them. Even when they mature, you should not abandon them. You should be there for them when they need you. And that's why we have this saying that we are in the business for ourselves, but not by ourselves. That is very, very true. So when you sponsor, you are there to be reached every other time that we need you as, a, as, as, a, as your downline, or when you, uh, you are needed, uh, you need your upline, they are there. You feel very good when you communicate and you're able to share and even to encourage one another. So why do we do uh, sponsoring? One, uh, you know when you're sponsoring, we said we are working with masses, you're looking for the cream of the crop to join your organization. That is, you want the right people. But most of the time, some right people will join and uh, sometimes the wrong people will join. So, but you don't prejudge, you bring all the people on board. And that's why we're saying, 
sponsoring is more than just recruiting. So because you, when you bring them on board, now you're able to uh, sieve them. You're going to sieve through the system and know exactly who to work with and also who to push around because we don't want to even throw them out even if they're not working. We want them to try as much as they can to work. So this is where you work with numbers. In network marketing, is a business of numbers. You bring about 10 people and only three of them, that's what we are told mostly, and it's true, I've uh, tested this and it's a fact, that mostly you find out of 10 people that you have brought into the system, only three will become uh, business builders or even do something small. So you find that the seven of them will either die automatically or they will just be there without renewing and without doing anything. So you have to work with many, many people. You have to bring so many people. So it is also uh, gives you a very powerful team because you know when you are talking about network marketing, you have to understand this. This is a relationship business. When you become a sponsor, you are directly related to this person. You have a good interest of this person. You have the well-being of this person at heart. So what you are doing, you are building a solid and reliable network. So being uh, the, the, the reason for sponsoring is that you have a very solid relationship uh, and also network. So we also have, uh, when you sponsor new people, you have new blood in your, in, your, in your team. And that is what makes your team grow. You don't just grow because of having the old uh, people. You have new blood, new people, new energy. So what leads to successful sponsoring? Because sponsoring will not just happen. There is a process. So what leads to this? One, you have to know the exact way of prospecting. Um, uh, we are talking about this because we, we as distributors, this is where we, we fail. We are supposed to sponsor many people. So how do we sponsor them? First, we start with proper prospecting. And who do you prospect? You prospect those people who you meet daily in Matatu, in social halls, anywhere. Those people we are being taught how to approach them and effectively, effectively uh, prospect, even get their contacts and put them in our name list. You remember we did a name list somewhere. So we put them, we add to our name list. We make sure that our name list is growing every day so that we don't have a dry uh, tap. So the other people that you talk to is your family and friends. I know many family members don't embrace what we do maybe because of uh, the saying that a prophet is not believed at home. I, I think mostly that's what a prize. Many people, many family members don't come on board immediately. So you have to keep preaching to them. And you know, uh, faith comes by hearing and hearing. So even in this, you have to make them hear and hear and hear. So families and friends, uh, you talk to them, you prospect them. You also do social uh, commerce. The social commerce is where you use the social media. And we have been, uh, of late, we've been taught more, more about the social media. And Aris, I know she's very conversant with this. Uh, Rydia Mwesa and our PTs, they know these things. And also I myself have uh, gotten into it and I've seen it working very well. So we get into social media use of Facebook, Instagram, uh, uh, WhatsApp, all those. We prospect from all that, uh, all those areas. We also, after prospecting, we know how to effectively invite. And inviting is bringing people to look to what you are offering. So you have to know exactly which tools to use. And we have many tools in the system. We have the CDs, we have the magazines, we have the videos, ETC, all those. We can use them to effectively invite our prospects to be able to come and see what we are doing. And after inviting, then it comes to uh, presentation. And this is the key. You have to get it right from the beginning. Uh, presentation is the key. We are told that the one who has the marker has the, has the money. So when you're presenting, you have the influence of those people who are listening to you. So and that's how you can now get uh, people to sponsor. So you started right with meetings. You invite people to meetings. We have nowadays we have virtual meetings like this one, the Zoom meeting, and we have physical meetings. Uh, we have gotten a place in a 680 hotel, 
uh, the second floor, room 27, uh, 217. That's a place which is open for every member to come and uh, present. So we, we do also events like regional events. We have uh, Nakuru meetings also. We have uh, uh, Narok meetings. We have Kisi meetings. And we are, we, are, we are going far and wide. Now we have Kakamega and Bugoma. So you can use those uh, meetings to do, to present your, your, your opportunity and people, you get uh, quite an opening for you to sponsor. Then after doing that, it is the forum. You do proper forum, which, you know, the fortune we are told always rise in the forum. And many people just leave those people who came for the presentation, thinking that they will come back to us and tell us that they will join. Most of the times they wait for call to action. So you have to make sure that you give them a call, a forum, and know that these people are now ready or you show them, you guide them through on what to do next. And they'll be very, very happy. So this is where most people go wrong because uh, after presentation, we leave that the, the, the thing just to take its own course. But we are supposed to follow up on these people and effectively make sure that we close the deal. So after four up, that's where you now get people to put into the system. And when you put those people into the system, they become your downlines. And what do you do? You mature them quickly by duplicating yourself in them. So this is where now the duplication comes in. And duplication is now helping your new downlines do exactly what you do to be successful. So you teach them the success formula and it is doing the same thing through and through again until it is as written in them and they're able now to follow. And mostly is when you call them to training like this one that they'll know exactly what is supposed to be done. So duplication is simply bringing people and showing them exactly what to do. You can peg them into small, small meetings and do those meetings for 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 one-on-one for -on -one or even uh, do uh, small group meetings, Zoom meetings, individual Zoom meetings. We are allowed to do that. No one is controlling you on that because this is your own business on your own terms. As long as you're following the company rules and regulations, the, that is allowed. So the benefits of uh, duplication is one, you grow your network quickly. Look at this, you bring few people and in a course of time, they bring another few people who in course of time also brings another few people and you find yourself having a very large organization. So that is the power of duplication. If you don't duplicate yourself, those people who you are, you are brought under you are not able to bring other people. So, and our desire is to bring people who will be able to build business for themselves and also help other people to build their own businesses. So you also have a team that can give results because we don't just want to recruit people who are not giving us results. We want results. So when you have people who are doing exactly what you're doing, the results are eminent. They are they're actually visible. That's uh, that, that the risk we can see. The, the, the results are visible and it's something that is tangible, which you can show and everyone will admire. Yeah, you, you also give a very independent downline. You get very independent downlines. When you do deprecation, they become very dependent very quickly. So with that, you are able to even continue doing uh, enlarging other regs or even widening your, your, your organization and it becomes very easy. So fellow distributors, let's work with uh, our downlines to grow our businesses or our teams and let us persist till, till we see the results. Because I know the more we continue uh, doing these trainings and the, the more we persist, the, 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 the quicker we see the results. So thank you very much for giving me this time. I think I was uh, brief enough to be understood and uh, let's keep training and training for you to earn, you have to train. Thank you very much. Back to our PTs. Wow, thank you so much, uh, Haron. I think that's a step-by-step -step, uh, process of um, 
how we need to do it. And if you are a new person uh, in the call, now you understand the business. Generally, that is what is uh, there in the business. Uh, so I want to appreciate Harold Masheria for taking your elaborate time to, you know, sufficient time to take us through. And that illustrates the simplicity of our business and how to do it in a way that you are building a solid business, not doing it in a hurry. And thanks Alice for the product session, because again, uh, if you do what Harun is uh, explaining to us, uh, but uh, the people you are sponsoring are not using the products, then you're not in, in a business. You're only paid when the products move. Only that if you are moving products alone, how much can you move? Versus if you are moving products with an organization of 100 people and you are being paid from the output of the 100 people, then definitely that's a huge business. By the way, uh, the difference between uh, the person in this call who has only maybe one or two people in the organization and myself, um, or rather the reason why they call me a president team member and you may be a senior manager or less is because of the size of the organization. So I am challenging us to do this. Let us embark on sponsoring. And uh, Harun has explained the difference between sponsoring and recruiting uh, in the simplest terms, just to uh, reiterate what he has said, uh, recruiting is just pushing people in and uh, your work ends there. When they are in, your work ends there. But for sponsoring, when they are in, your work begins there uh, because you are now to work with them until they are mature in the business. Now, my point is this, let's consistently bring in people and we nurture them. Don't be tempted to look at the results too early. Because sometimes you bring them, they don't work. And you know, honestly, let's be honest on this one. Each one of us here is building their own independent business. I built mine. You, even being part of Superstars team, you are building yours. And you should do, build it to the top, just like I did in mine. You know, That's why when the company is paying you, they only pay you from the size of the business you have. Um, how many downlines you have. And for me, they pay me depending on the size of mine. So I'm encouraging us, uh, don't be tempted to look at the results too early and you conclude that it's not working. If you have brought some people who are not maybe keen on building the business, what do you do? Keep looking for others who are serious. As long as yourself, you are serious. And we are not saying that you do away with the, anyone but allow those who want to move all the way to the top to do it. And those who are not in a hurry, let them keep coming at their own pace. So the only control you have, ladies and gentlemen, the only control you have is bringing in new people. Because when you bring in new people, you cannot control what they do, but you can be able to bring in others. And this is the magic in our business. As you continue bringing in people, you'll find that one person, those three, four, five people who are so committed and they decide they want to build the business all the way to president level. And my friend, when you get such people, your life will never be the same again. That is how you become a multimillionaire. And as we build this business, let's remember, it's not a small business. It's only that it starts small. But when you look at the potential in our business, then you will do it in a mega, mega way. You'll do it with a lot of commitment and um, you'll experience huge success. Now, it is at this juncture that we want to recognize those people who are really sponsoring. And please, it's not over until it's over. Remember, we still have a couple of days to go. Someone might not be in the list today, but with commitment and determination, they will be among the top in sponsoring come the end of this week. And I encourage us to move faster in the remaining days. 
just before I do the recognition, which I want uh, all of us to really uh, be around to appreciate those who are um, being recognized, I want to challenge all of us to make sure that you get it right in uh, prospecting from Facebook. I want to give us homework. Majority of the directors have already created uh, two pages on their Facebook um, uh, account. That is a business page and products page. Don't do it without consulting your applied director. Consult so that you come up with pages that will just be giving you people throughout. Yes, I, I mean that. If you do it well, you'll get people coming in, coming in, coming in, coming in. You'll not have the problem of who will I talk to. So I challenge you to link up with your applying director and ask them, how do I create uh, you know, the Facebook pages for my business so that I'm able to sponsor very many and so that I'm able to also uh, get high personal PVs through the product page. This evening, I just called one of us uh, for like uh, 35, 40 minutes, and we created two pages for, for uh, products and the other one for business. So tomorrow now, I'll be showing them how you use those pages to generate so many leads. People who are uh, coming to you, asking you for the opportunity, asking you for the business, I mean, uh, for the product. Isn't that interesting? Uh, for sure it is. Uh, and what we want is yeah, before the end of um, November, those who are very committed to build a huge business, you should be able to sponsor up to 10, 20 personal. You know, someone is sponsoring zero now. And if you embrace what we are discussing, you'll be surprised that you can sponsor 10 from zero. You can sponsor 10 in a single man uh, personal. So let's see who have been able to sponsor this far. And I would just use uh, like five minutes or less to do this. Um, allow me to share my screen. And Alice and uh, Harun, you are able to unmute yourself and clap for these people. So we want to start with um, personal sponsoring. Okay, now there are those who have sponsored one. And uh, please let's uh, clap for them, starting with Bonfas Moranga. Congratulations. Aaron Damaris Masharia, leading by example. Well done. Uh, Sylvia Buibo, Redemptor Chero Teach, Jane Hungura, Sister Luce Duo. Congratulations. Uh, Helen Sichangi, congratulations. Joyce Ondari, well done. Mary Cuchillo, Douglas Giro, Father Santulino Ekanda, Sister Georgina Shitabasi, Christopher Wabwile, Father Lucas Duma, Hesbon Nyagowa, Eunice Kirago, Grace Tong. All those people have sponsored one each. Now, I want you to observe something here. I want to appreciate a certain group of people who are joining our business in a big way, and they are really uh, sponsoring. I can see Sister Lucy Duo. I can see Father Santurino Ekanda. I can see uh, uh, Sister Georgina. I can see Father Lucas. What does that tell you? That uh, the clergy has decided to go full swing in building the business, to help people to go to heaven, yes, but to go to heaven healthy and uh, excited and uh, not uh, broke, you know? Yeah, so thank you so much, um, uh, the fathers and sisters who are doing a spectacular job uh, here. Even when the church is providing, um, you know, Sandra. Now, anyway, let's go to the next uh, uh, group. That is people who have sponsored two. And this is now the position number three. And we have Constantina Sang. Congratulations, Constantina Sang. 
<laughs> then we have our director, Lydia Muesa. Well done. And we have Christine Odari. Very good job done. Remember, when you sponsor three, you get an incentive of aloe vera, I mean, of uh, LDC from your applied director. So let's see if anyone who has sponsored three, position number uh, two, uh, sponsored three. Yes, we have Stella Chaburet and Dr. William, our brand new director, last month, but one. Well done. Uh, this month, they are working towards hitting their Emerald Director. They'll be our brand new Emerald Director. When you become an Emerald Director, on top of the monthly bonus for a director, you get an extra 6,800. Imagine. Very exciting. So congratulations, Stella and uh, William. And position number one, sponsored five so far, uh, Josphat and Piero's karaoke. And um, I'm looking for someone to challenge us, please. I promise you by the next recognition, it will not be five. But I know there is someone in this call who will have sponsored many more than myself. And I will have a special gift for them. Okay. Now let's also recognize those who have done high personal. No, before you go to that, that's the incentive we are talking about of LDC. And if the three people you have sponsored have done 100 points, you get a Lovera Plus juice, two bottles from the company in addition to the LDC. Of course, in our team, if you have sponsored five instead of three, now instead of getting LDC, you get 3,000 I mean, 3, Kenya shares. So those are the other incentives that I've just talked about there. Better plus juice, the sweetest juice ever. If you have not taken this, oh, you are joking. Wow. The thing is sweet, man. So let's recognize those who have uh, done some high personal PV so far, although this is the week to change the game. This is the week to change the game. I mean, if you, you, you know, joke around here, you are in this list, you're not even okay. being top 10 next, come next recognition, because this is the week that people do massive PVs so that they can okay. have good bonuses. But as it is now, our top 10 is, sorry, I've uh, not arranged them in the order, but number 10 is Daniel Manene, uh, congratulations, Daniel. And then uh, that is Daniel and the Faith Manene, 323. Then we have number nine, Sister Georgina Shitabasi, only three, four days old and has done all these PVs. Then Father Lucas Juma, uh, 399 PVs. Position number seven, Hezbo Nyagoa has been doing an amazing job, 509 points. Frederick and Doreen Aluda, 524 personal PV. They are very determined, by the way, to become directors this month of um, October. Mm -hmm. and, uh, please say a short prayer before you sleep. Sorry, uh, mute yourself if your background is noisy in my recognition team. Then we have number five, Alice Monyenze, 525, our director. I, I saw Alice. Uh, selling within a day, cases and cases of aloe vera, vera plus juice. So when she's talking of the harbors, she knows exactly what uh, uh, should be done. Then position number four is Okech Florence and Orao. Let me mention Orao because I've had him name this behind there. Uh, Okech Florence and Orao, 539 uh, personal PVs. Then now the top three, we have number three, Eddie Dokoki, 552 personal PVs. Um, yes. Position number two, we have Reverend Samuel Moshoga, 565. An amazing job. And position number one, we have Joseph and Fieros, 945 personal PVs. So, uh, a quick reminder, those who are becoming directors this month, uh, September, October, November, we are going to uh, give you 10,000 cash incentive in addition to your bonus, and we will treat you in a five-star hotel, a whole day lifestyle event at the beginning of uh, December. Those who are becoming one team, you have bed and breakfast uh, treatment in a five-star hotel. So 
that marks the end of our recognition and I want to appreciate each one of us. My closing remark is this. It is not how you start and the man. You know, there are some people who start very fast, but within three days, they stop. They get really no much, you know, reward. But winners are determined at the finishing line. Now the month ends on 1st of November. How I really wish that all of us, we move at the highest speed with the highest, you know, all the energy that we can and we close strong and you increase your bonus. We say this, that the company writes um, an empty check, bonus check. You are the one to write the amount of money you want. While people are saying that the economy is tough, why don't you use the remaining days to maximize on your PVs, sponsor more, uh, order more products, and you make a huge uh, bonus. When you get a good bonus, it encourages more people to join, so it goes higher and higher, and that is how you find yourself getting up to one million plus plus in that event. So God bless you so much. Enjoy your evening. And uh, let's move very swiftly. We are waiting to celebrate our brand new directors for the month of October. Oh, we cannot wait. So executive managers, take the step. Senior managers, step up to senior managers, step up to manager. Don't close the month being where you are. May God bless you so much. Thank you all of us for attending the training. Remember, as Piero said at the beginning, not training, then you're not in business. Wow, thank you so much and God bless each